Hello YouTube. Um, I figured I'd finally shoot a video of my uh, Sega AK-47 762x39, of course. Um, it's for safety purposes for YouTube. This weapon has been safety checked. There is nothing in the chamber. Here how smooth that is. And I even used the clear polymer Pro Mags. Legit mags though. I'm not the sturdiest in the world, but, you know, once again, legit mags. Um, I did all the work myself. Uh, this thing has changed quite a bit since the day I got it out of the box. Um, one of the most obvious is the front rail system here. It's a UTG quad rail mount, um, top, sides, and bottom, equipped with a UTG flashlight. If you will close your eyes behind the camera, right, as you see. Um, it's also got a government issue beam shot laser. You know, great in the daytime, up to 50, 75 yards, even in the cats as we see. Nighttime, out to about a mile, mile and a half. Um, I have a primary arms 30 millimeter red dot sight, um, seven different reticles, I'm sorry, four different reticles, seven, seven light settings, um, and it's mounted onto a a Kalinka removable side rail mount. You know, so you know, God forbid if something should ever happen to my my optics, I can go back to my trusty red sights, iron sights, sorry, uh, which are dead on. So um, yeah, I recently dura coated it. If you notice, in a two coat, OD green and matte black with the gas tube and barrel black and most of the receiver except for the dust cover there and uh, the matte black. I'm sorry, in the uh, OD green. Um, yeah, boat rubber grip, mag pull, vertical front grip, make a stock with adjustable cheek rest, and it also folds in. Does not fold all the way in, the, in with the sight mounted on, but you know, won't be shooting from the hip with the sight either. So, um, also do have these couple other mags, a couple surplus Sega mags. Pro Mags loaded, of course. It's North Carolina. We're shooting first stick, so don't get any funny ideas. You know, trash it. But yeah, um, the base price on these they run about about seven fifty, eight hundred converted. Um, I believe worth every penny. Uh, I've also mounted ambidextrous sling mounts here, and um, worth every penny. There's a Taco G2 trigger on it. Super reliable, um, accurate as any of the rifle I've fired. People argue uh, the AR is more accurate than EKAs and vice versa. I believe it comes down to the shooter and this rifle and I have, have maintained great grouping. Um, yeah, but well over 500 rounds through it. And, uh, and I'm, I'm a big fan of the rifle. So, hope you've enjoyed the video. Leave me any comments, questions, and uh, thanks for watching.